everybody, this is Tembiota coming at you with another third party Transformers video review. This time we have Fans Project Retro Future Fangor. This Retro Future project is, I think, pretty fun. It's They've made new figures that look like old Transformers, uh, even down to the way that the box art looks, where it looks old with taking the stickers and putting half of them on, leaving half of them off. I think this was a little a fun kind of thing that they did and you know making new figures and and making them look old and retro style so let's go ahead and look at the box right here and you can see this is a a cartoon kind of old style drawing of Fangor in his robot mode right here really reminiscent of you know the old G1 days where they <laughs> didn't look anything like what the toy looked like so we'll uh, turn around and you can see here's a here's a picture of him uh, in his in his toy mode or in his uh, robot mode and then on the back you can see him and you can see which piece he becomes and then you can see a kind of a shadowy outline of the uh, of Glacial Lord and you can see him on this side in his beast mode and then you go on the top and you see both of them and then you look at the bottom and you have some uh, warning labels and such so let's go ahead and uh, get this guy open and actually you know what I'm just gonna open them up like this because it's it's kind of the packaging is kind of neat you know you look at it it looks like there's you know scuff marks and creases and all that stuff but that's all printed onto the box it's it's not actually really there so, um, but if you open up the box you'll look and it comes in styrofoam you know styrofoam insert and then it has a little a little I don't know what they call him a headmaster or a little core bot but you know you get this and it looks like it's old it looks like it's been through a lot but it's that's just printed on there so you get his weapon you get the figure and like I said whenever you get the the stickers, like half of them are put on and half of them aren't. So um, that's the way that they come. And then the instructions, they're done in the old G1 style where you, you pull them out like this and it's you know like a runner type thing. Uh, I don't know how to ex accordion fold. Um, but yeah, that's the instructions. So these are really, uh, these are really neat. So, forward so I uh, these actually come on here and I actually cut it open to get the figure out so uh, pull that out and then you'll take this portion right here and attach it to there and that'll make his tail and then you can take the, the, the little figure and you can push that panel back see these see half the like I said half the stickers are already put on there um, go like that and he can ride in the beast mode bring this down for you a little bit you can ride in the in the beast mode and stuff and uh, if you want a little rundown of the articulation in this motor right here you have um, forward and back right here at the at the uh, the front shoulder at the back shoulder there's nothing right here uh, you do have something right here but you know you can kind of see the fist but that's okay. It's it's supposed to be done in that style. So it's um, his mouth does open and close. His head um, you can kind of move it around a little bit. It's it's the head does come off. Yeah, you can make it look down. Um, and then to make it look up, you would have to fold that up like that. So um, that that's about it for for this mode. But if you want to transform him, I'm going to take this guy off. And we'll go ahead and pop the head off, put that off to the side, pop this off, extend this, flip these little feet up, and this comes out like that, this comes out like that, you flip this back like that, and then you're going to take this guy right here and he becomes the head uh, and the chest piece. So you flip this part forward and this part up. And then the sticker's already applied uh, for that part. And then you slide him into here. You take one of his guns and you can put it on that hand or wherever. Um, 
and then you can take this one right here and you can flip that out and there's a handle right there you flip that like that uh, actually you know, sorry I uh, I didn't transform that right so you flip that out you flip that like that this is how you make his gun um, you flip that into there And you clip that onto his hand. And that makes his that makes his weapon. All right, and then um, articulation is pretty much the same. You get the shoulder right here. You don't get anything in the legs, um, and uh, nothing in the head. So uh, you can go like that to move the hands up and down if you want to, kind of kind of things. But that that's that's about all you get there. Um, you know, like I said, it's it's made in that style where it's supposed to be like that. So, Actually, these these things really do remind me of my childhood. These are these are really nice. Uh, all right, so that's going to be it for Fans Project Retro Future Glacial Lord Fangor figure. And don't forget to check out my other reviews. Subscribe, follow me on Twitter. This has been Tambiot, and I'll see you next time.